Hello everyone. This channel provides the latest information on the Three Gorges Dam. If you are interested, please subscribe to our channel. The world is paying attention to the dam. Local time, at 8 a.m. on the 25th, the water level of the Three Gorges Dam is 159.40 meters. Compared with the water level of the day before yesterday, it is almost unchanged. On the storage side of the Three Gorges Dam, the water level is around here. At 6 a.m. this morning, the discharge of the Three Gorges Dam was 6,130 cubic meters per second. The maximum discharge of hydropower at this dam is 30,000 cubic meters per second. So it's about 20% power generation, which is also normal. A simple calculation shows that around 7 turbines are in operation. The dam has 32 turbines and has the world's highest power generation capacity. Despite this, only 7 generators are in operation. I'm a little unsure if it's working properly. According to the dam data, the water level has not changed much since the beginning of November. On the other hand, the amount of water entering the dam is decreasing slightly. They should have raised the water level to 175 meters. However, they cannot stop the discharge and need to release a certain amount of water downstream for river maintenance in the downstream area. Upstream observatories likewise remain at low levels of inflow. We hear that the economic situation is deteriorating, but behind the scenes, the critical situation of water shortages continues. Nishiyan Channel Let's check the current situation about the water level of the Three Gorges Dam. Here is the data for the end of October. The water level peaked out just before 160 meters. And I'll post the data from November onwards. As I mentioned at the beginning, recently, the water level has tended to go down a little. This time last year, the water level was already 175 meters, so the difference is nearly 15 meters. Looking ahead, I don't think there will be any major changes until the end of the year. Here is the extraordinary news. Foxconn China Factory offered allowances for retirement conditions. CNN Japan reports. According to the article, Foxconn has announced that it will pay approximately $1,400 to newly hired employees at its iPhone manufacturing site, subject to their retirement. This is a measure to contain employee protests. The protest has led to hundreds of employees clashing with security forces. So far, I have told you about the Foxconn factory in China, which offered to provide allowances as part of the retirement conditions. This is a graph of the annual water level of the Three Gorges Dam. Until June, it was in the phase of lowering the water level. From July to August, the amount of rain gradually increases. As the amount of water flowing into the dam increases, they respond by increasing the discharge rate. Even so, the water level gradually rises due to the large inflow. At the end of the flood season, they raise the water level to 175 meters due to hydropower and irrigation water for the following year. Although there are some deviations, it looks like this every year. Various problems have been pointed out at the Three Gorges Dam, as covered in this channel. They don't mention any of the potential concerns I have such as the climate impact, the large amount of trash, the negative impact on the ecosystem, and the persistent sand problem. They claim that the dam is operating safely, but I doubt it. The annual precipitation around the Three Gorges Dam is as follows. It's finally November, but this year we're still experiencing a historic lack of rain. From July to September, there was little rainfall in the Yangtze Basin. As far as this channel has investigated, the area covered by the Three Gorges Dam is the red line. Now let's check windy. It's been raining lately around the dam and in the downstream area. Heavy rain is also forecast for the rest of the week. Water levels in previously dry downstream lakes are likely to rise. It seems that the temperature drops considerably, and there are days when it drops below zero degrees. On the one hand, they cannot expect rain upstream of the dam. The height of the dam is limited to 185 meters. The Three Gorges Dam has various problems. 
Originally, the Three Gorges Dam was supposed to be built mainly for flood control, but along the way, roles such as hydroelectric power generation and operation of large ships were added. If the water level is lowered too much, it will affect hydroelectric power generation and large ships will not be able to pass through. Therefore, the water level cannot be lowered below 145 meters. Although the dam is 185 meters high, the flood control range is only 30 meters for power generation and water transport. At this 30 meters, we have to raise and lower the water level to survive the summer flood season. In this photo, the red structure on top of the dam. I think this is a crane, but do you know how big it is? It's not very noticeable when viewed from a distance, but it seems to be quite big when viewed from a close distance. You can see the car at the foot of the crane. The height of a passenger car is about 1.5 meters, so if you count it visually, it seems to be about 16 cars high. Is it about 24 meters? A typical condominium is about 3 meters per floor, so it seems to be equivalent to an 8-story condominium. This giant crane rides on rails and moves the dam from side to side. By the way, do you all know the word, protection dam? Is it a dam beside the main dam? I did a lot of research on the definition of protected dams, but none of them came to my mind. So I don't know if this is the case, but it seems that the Three Gorges Dam also has a protected dam. Let's check with Google Earth. Looking near the Three Gorges Dam, the back of the screen is downstream and the front is upstream. The center is the dam body. Let's look a little closer. Then you can see the artifact. Compared to the surroundings, it looks quite large. Compared to the dam body, it may be about one kilometer long. And it is the circle mark in the back. The fact that the road is so undulating is likely to be about 150 meters high. And if you look at the width, it is estimated to be about 300 meters. The details are unknown, but it looks like a rock fill dam. What if this collapses because of the discovery of a new artifact? Another factor of anxiety was found. I tried to summarize the petite information of the Three Gorges Dam. This video is a popular video that has been played over 100,000 times, so please enjoy it. The URL is listed in the summary section. It's already the dry season. Last year, heavy rains and floods continued, and there was fear that the dam might collapse. This year, things are completely different. Conversely, this year has been a drought, and the state of extremely low water continues. Please continue to subscribe to our channel for the latest information.